folks. Good morning. Your future mayor, Funkston Meridian here, about to discuss his policy on something that is very near and dear to his heart. Very near and dear. It's very important to the survival, to the, the city of Wichita Falls down, maintaining its wonderful ability to not grow its citizenry, to maintain its ability to not grow its tax base. It's very vital because, folks, one of the most important questions around the citizenry of Wichita Falls Down is this. Do you support Lake Wichita? Folks, do you support Lake Wichita Falls Down? Do you support it? And, folks, let me tell you, do you specifically support the beautification of the city of Wichita Falls Down? Because, folks, let's be honest, that right there. That right there, that bird flying, that tree, all the reeds, that is ugly, folks. It's quite ugly. And we must beautify it, folks. We must. And folks, let me try to explain this the best way I can. I will take the wondrous decisions over the last 35 years pertaining to this very ugly lake, this very ugly body of water, what we call a big pond where I come from, I mean... I can walk across it in probably five to seven minutes, but that's okay. We're going to beautify it, and I am all for that. And folks, I am going to take some of the wonderful decisions that they did, and I'm going to magnify them because I feel, I feel strongly about maintaining the fact that we lose citizenry in the citizens in the in the city of Wichita Falls down. I'm, I'm going to I'm going to take that, and but again, folks, like Wichita Falls down, folks. About four to five years ago, when you walked out here, during the time of the drought, you could literally, right here at this point, right here, there, there, was, a, there was a truck out in the middle of that. There was a truck. You could walk all the way across that, folks. You could walk all the way across that. And in order to beautify this lake, what are the things that's supposed to be done? And folks, I've commented on this before, but it was only as a citizen, not as a mayor candidate. You... You could have, in order to beautify this thing, one of the things that's wrong with this is the water is, is bad. It cannot support fish and things like that. All these birds flying around here, they're, they're going to die eventually. I mean, that's just what's going to happen because the water kills people, folks. It's, it's very bad. And one of the things that you're going to have to do in order to fix the water is you're going to have to dredge, which means to remove all the soot and uh, the sediment and stuff that's at the bottom of this lake, and you're going to have to make it a little bit deeper, folks. I mean, you're going to have to remove this, the water, the, remove the dirt. And in order to do that, all of this water right here is going to have to be let out. It's going to have to be drained. And folks, three to five years ago, for, for, for many years when it was empty, most folks would have thought that, you know, hey, why don't we just dredge that sucker right now? But you know what, folks? And that's something I thought about. I thought about that. But I did not know that that just could not be done. I thought, well, hell, it makes sense. Why don't we do that? I did not know that they had to do a study to find out what would happen if they dredged it. And, and the, there was more water in the lake now because they only built that dam, that new dam that's down there. They only built that to support a dead, a, an ugly Lake Wichita. They did not build that dam to to support water in a beautiful Lake Wichita. So that is one of the reasons that right now they did not do that. And that's absolutely brilliant, folks, because, I mean, again, it, it's going to cost more money to empty the lake and then dredge it and then wait for it to be filled back up again. And, and one of those questions about that is what if people quit praying for rain and then the lake will never fill back up again? And then we just have a beautiful hole, just have a beautiful home, folks. And I'm all right with that. So in order to maintain the wondrous decisions about beautify ugly lake, which falls down is, I, I, when, when I am mayor, we will take many more years to do this and we will spend more money on studies because folks, studies is what we do. The city of Wichita falls down. It is what has maintained our population at negative 73% growth every year. It is why people don't want to come and live here and why our community is so wonderful. That, and and I'm, going to, I'm going to do studies just like they do. I mean, one of the questions of the studies is when we beautify Lake Wichita and more people come, 
Will there be more accidents and could there be some drownings with more people? Where I'm going to fund a study of that of $786 trillion. That is a study that must be done. We are going to fund a study to see if we will allow people to use salmon eggs or if they'll only be able to use artificial lures to fish. We're going to have to do a study on that. That will take three to five years on that study. That's going to be $787 trillion as well. We're going to fund a study to see if is there a possibility that an alligator might want to come live here? I mean, if an alligator wants to come live here, folks, we are done. We've seen what alligators can do. So we're going to have to do a study on that. We're going to have to do a study to see if reporters with one legs and PTSD can swim around and, and enjoy themselves. Because we don't know if they're going to like that or not. I mean, we, we, we don't know if they're going to like that. So we're going to have to do a study to do that. We're going to have to do a study to see if all 17 bike riders might accidentally veer off to the right if they're going east and going to the water and drown. That's a study we're going to have to do. We're going to have to fund a study to see if the improved water quality of a dredged lake, how it's going to affect the flying patterns of all the all the, um, all the Frisbee players at the disc park right over there because the winds are going to obviously... All the wind's going to be different coming off a beautified lake as compared to an ugly lake. We're going to have to fund a study to see if 17 more people might use it on a Tuesday afternoon at a cost of $486 trillion to see if we want to do that. And we're going to have to fund a study to see if we're going to allow suburbans to back their, their car, their, their boats in here, or if it's only going to be smart cars. I mean, we're going to have to fund a study on that, folks. We're going to have to study all these things. We're going to have to fund a study to see if trees are going to grow better. We're going to have to fund a study to see if it needs to be six feet dredged or eight feet dredged. We're going to have to do a study on these folks. And here's the deal. I am going to fund all of these. I'm going to fund them and I, I'm going to think about them while I'm in office, office. Because folks, I will be in office for the rest of my life. I mean, because I'm going to make myself permanent mayor because that's what I can do. But folks, you just have to realize in order to make a great mayor, you have to take what this wonderful city has done and just do it exponentially, folks. And that's what I will do. I will fund a study to see if I look good standing next to the lake. I figure that's going to be another hundred million dollars because, I mean, I know the results of the study. Someone as gorgeous as me standing next to something obviously makes it more beautiful, but that's just a study that has to be done. So, folks... I went a little longer than five minutes because the the beautification of the ugly Lake Wichita Falls Down is very near and dear to my heart, and I think it's something that we just should do. So I kind of rambled and went over a little more than five minutes. But if you want to see some more thoughts on my uh, on my thoughts, it, there's some videos earlier that I did on Lake Wichita Falls Down. I mean, it's such a wonderful place, folks. If you have not come out here, go ahead and get out here. I mean, you're going to get bit by some beautiful, well, the ugly mosquitoes right now because we haven't done a study to see if they're beautiful mosquitoes. But folks, this is one of the things I will do. I will make this ugly Lake Wichita Falls Down beautiful all at your expense. Your future mayor, Function Meridian. Good day.